Busy CADCAM, a world-class leader for the manufacturing industry. TST as well as Busy introduce our Progress software. Busy Progress is changing the industry with a modern user interface, industry-specific functionality, helping to reduce error while also increasing productivity, and with powerful unfolding commands. This is the part we will be unfolding. Our first step is to extract the skin. This will allow us to easily work with the data to help unfold it. Now we'll select a material. Visi already includes an extensive database of materials that you can select from. Now that we have our skin data, we will translate it over. Each of these translations will be a different stage on our strip. So now we're going to create our binder surface. We're going to select this inner surface as a basis for it. So now that we've extracted that, we'll hide the original data and we'll fix this up so we can create a binder surface from this data. So just like that, we are able to close all the holes. Now we're going to extend all the edges of it so it's larger than our part. So now we have that, we'll bring our data back in. After we change the color so it's a little more easily identifiable. So now we can start unfolding. So all we have to do is pick one edge, which we'll do by selecting this edge filter. Then after we select one edge, it'll automatically grab all other edges by tangency. Next we'll select our binder, hit preview, we can see the unfolded flange. Now we can confirm. Now we'll translate it over for the next stage and do the same thing with the other flange. So we'll grab this lower one, grab the right edge, and just like that, it once again grabs all the tangent edges. This time we won't keep the binder, and we'll hit preview. And if, once we like the results, we can hit confirm. Now we have the unfolded flange. So now we'll translate it over for another stage. Here we're going to remove the holes and the draw bead. So once again, using the close to solid command to remove the holes. Then we'll use the delete extract face command this time. Then this time we're going to use delete and heal instead of extract to remove this data while also healing the hole that it would leave behind. There we grabbed a little extra soul to just unselect that. So now that we've removed that data, we'll translate it over one more stage. And this will be our flat blank. So we'll use a different command here, busy blank. We'll select our part, it's going to quickly generate results, and then we want to select the starting point for our strip plane. This will be where the carrier attaches on our strip. Now, after we have our blank result, we can then delete all the extra data we used in modeling, then go to create a solid data for our surfaces. So we can just highlight all of them at once, and then just like that, we will have the solid data for our parts. Now we can move on to our strip study. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions, please contact us by phone at 248-922-9293 or visit us at our website at www.tst-software.com.